Welcome back. We are back in Chicago. I am so excited to be home. Arizona was great. Oh, I have a lot to update you guys on. I guess let's just start. Arizona was great. The weather was beautiful the whole time we were there. I was very sad that I didn't get to see my family, but it was like the trip with the girls was like the trip of a lifetime that was amazing but the whole entire reason we went out to arizona was because we we're selling our house out there long story short the buyer did the inspection and came back with a bunch of stuff that they wanted us to fix some really big ticket items like some really expensive things and we agreed to do it and we started all the work on it and then after everything had been started and everything was going ahead the loan company found out that our buyer didn't declare all of her student debt and so the loan company revoked her loan offer and she was not able to buy our house. So that's been a doozy to deal with. We've basically been like trying to figure out what to do moving forward now and we don't have a full conclusion, but I'll keep you guys updated. But that was not the most fun thing to deal with. But like overall, being in Arizona was great. It was nice to have some sun, some warm weather, but I am so excited to be home. Like I'm so excited to be back in my routine and working from home and everything because it's just not the same when you're not in your own space. Got my negative COVID test, which was two thumbs up, good to go. But now I came home and let me just show you. I have all of these packages that I haven't opened because I've been gone. So let's start off today's video with a massive Christmas unboxing. I know what some of these are, but some of these are a complete mystery to me. This one is a mystery. I have no idea what this is. It says it's from Touch Beauty. Oh, I did know about this. I just totally forgot. Okay, it calls it a face massager, but it's basically kind of like a Clarisonic. It has a cleansing brush head, two scalp massage heads. This is fun. This is like Christmas 2.0. This is from Bubble Goods. So Bubble Goods is like an online grocery store and they have all sorts of different foods on there and you can sort it by like your dietary preference. So if you're keto, paleo, yada, yada, you can pick through that. And they also like really make an effort to support female founded businesses or businesses founded by people of color and like more sustainable brands. So that's super cool. I ordered a bunch of groceries from them. By the time this video posts, go over to my Instagram. I currently have a giveaway going on right now. That is for a $75 gift basket from Bubble Goods. And they're going to pick some awesome items to send over to you. So I'm trying some out this week. I'm very excited. I reached out to my mom and asked her what I should get. And she told me to get this pasta sauce. Yeah. So your mama's vodka sauce. So I got that and I got a couple different types of like, I got like an edamame spaghetti and a chia seed spaghetti. So once those come, I think I'll do that for dinner. All right, next one is from Vital Proteins. This I'm super, super excited about. If you've watched my Trader Joe's hauls, you will have seen at some point that I always buy collagen. I put it in my coffee. It doesn't taste like anything, but I do notice a huge difference in my hair and nails. So my nails always like peel at the tips. So collagen really, really helps with that. And it just makes my hair really healthy. Vital Proteins offered to send me some products and I'm super excited. Oh my gosh. There's a lot of things in here and I'm really excited. I've tried their like plain collagen before, but they have like all these fun ones that they sent me and I can't wait. Oh my gosh, there's so much stuff in here. So this one is just their original collagen peptides. I've tried this before, it completely tasteless. It melts in my coffee and I don't even notice it. Then this is their matcha collagen and I love matcha drinks. So this one has caffeine in it and the collagen. I'm excited to see how this one tastes. Coconut collagen creamer. It sounds like it'd be really good with the coconut cold brew from Trader Joe's. The vanilla collagen creamer, this sounds like right up my alley. I love vanilla coffee. Then this one I'm very, very excited for. This is the Collagen Beauty Glow. It's a lavender lemon flavor. Whole30 approved, dairy-free, gluten-free. And then the last one, I think I'm gonna try this one tonight. This is the Blueberry Moon Milk Latte. It has melatonin and magnesium for restful sleep. It's made with coconut milk powder. Oh yeah, I'm gonna try this one tonight. This sounds so good. So exciting! Yay! Thank you, Vital Proteins. That's fun. My next box is from Public Goods. I have talked about Public Goods in my videos all the time. All of the links for all of these things are gonna be in the description box. This is a lot of stuff. I hope you enjoy unboxings, because if you don't, this is not a fun start of a video for you. Public Goods has been in my videos a ton because I love their products. They reached out to me because they started a CBD line, and I have done videos on CBD before. If you haven't seen my anxiety video, I get really raw and open with y'all about all my anxiety and issues. And I talk about how like CBD truly has helped me so much managing my anxiety. They have these CBD oil capsules now that they just came out with. And so they sent me these to try. Vegan soft gel and it has 20 milligrams of CBD, which is like about as much as I normally take. So they reached out and asked me if I want to try those. I said, ask a freaking Lutely. And then also the girl is so sweet. She messages me and goes, also I threw in a surprise for Louie because she knew that he loves them. What is this? What is this? Are they for you? All right, you can have one. Louie, give me a high five if you love public goods. Good job, there you go. Oh, he's so cute. 
All right, we are chugging away. Oh my God, this is so much stuff. I, I think I know what this is. I mean, I'm stupid excited. This is from Liquid IV, and I've seen some other people opening their Liquid IV PR boxes, so I'm hoping that they sent me the same one that they sent other people, but you never know, you never know. Okay, I'm gonna be honest. This is the first time I feel like I've gotten like a legit PR package. Brands send me like random things every once in a while, but you see big influencers with proper PR packages. This is a proper PR package. Oh my God, this is ridiculous. Look at it. Kygo. Yes. Okay, so Liquid IV partnered with Kygo, which legit Kygo is probably my favorite music artist of all time. He's your like, favorite music artist of all time? Yes. Do you remember I went to his concert and I cried because I blacked out and didn't remember it the I next do day? Yes. No, I haven't opened it yet. I just want to hold it. Okay, I just, you want can to feel, I just want to feel the weight. Yeah, I was really proud of myself, like probably like junior year of college. Hello, <gasps> <sighs> Xander. Okay, I'm putting this back down. Oh my oh! god. Oh my gosh, oh wait. Is that a real record? No. <laughs> but yeah, junior year of college, like Spotify notified me that I was like one of the first people to really listen to all of Kaiko's music. I don't even remember. I don't remember what the stat was, but I remember being like, that's cool, love that. And then senior year of college, I went to a Kaigo concert and he didn't come on until like one in the morning and I drank too much and don't remember it. And I woke up the next day and legit cried. Kaigo is one of my favorites. And the fact that they partnered with Liquid IV is so cool. I drink a Liquid IV like every single day. We're in Arizona. That place is dry. I'll show you what this looks like because it's so pretty. Oh, so cute. And there's this record. Oh my God, I did get the whole PR package. I didn't know if they would send it to me. So freaking cool. Okay, number one, this is the new one they came out with. This is the Pina Colada flavor. They also sent me this water bottle. I'm spoiled. They sent me wireless headphones. Dude, this is a legit PR package. I'm pumped. All right, this next one I'm like super confused by because it's from Nordstrom and I didn't order anything and I don't think Nordstrom randomly sent me a box. Oh, <gasps> shut up. It's from Jeanette. What did she send me? I'm gonna cry. I'm already sweating. Oh, and I didn't get until now. What if she thinks I hate her? Okay, before I open this, Jeanette is somebody who found me on YouTube and I helped her find an apartment. She watches Cooking with Kai and now I just feel like we're friends. Oh my God, it's gift wrapped. I don't deserve this, whatever this is. It's very heavy. <gasps> you don't understand. It's La Crusette cooking wear. Oh my God, Alex, these are so nice. Are they? These are like creme de la creme of like cookware. What do they do? I've never owned anything from them. I'm so excited. Jeanette, I'm gonna cry. Oh, my whole heart. So freaking nice. I like, I'm afraid to touch them. They're so beautiful. Oh, I'm so excited. This week on Cookie with Kai. We are gonna clean up the insane mess around us. So I'm gonna go. I'll check in with you tomorrow. I'm here at Glam Room. I'm about to go in. I have not been here since before Christmas, like what, the 21st or the 19th or something? My eyelashes are all gone and my eyebrows are like super overgrown. I literally just texted her a photo of my face and I was like, what do we do first? <laughs> Cause my skin is breaking out, my eyebrows are crazy. And she was like, girl, we gotta get you in the door. So this is like my happy place. My week is so freaking busy. And this is like the one thing that I do for myself. I can't wait to go lay down in that chair and just freaking chill for a little bit. Here we go. Make me beautiful. <laughs> we will, we will. <laughs> I need help. I just can't get over. Good morning. It is a Saturday morning. I feel like we've fallen into this routine now of like vlog opening, Saturday morning cleaning, show you some apartments. I feel like this is a good time. Oh, I'm quite sleepy still. Louis is eating his breakfast. Are you eating? And it is a very gray and a little bit snowy day out here in Chicago. It snowed all day yesterday and it was so pretty. And finally, some of the snow stuck because normally the snow doesn't stick very much here. We have some snow on the ground now. Also, there was a car crash literally right outside of our apartment last night. And what's crazy is we didn't hear the actual crash. I don't know how we didn't hear it. We didn't hear the crash. What we heard was this guy got out and he's like screaming at these other people. Lots of profanity. It was a lot. We thought he was gonna fight these girls at some point. It was like three women that came out of the other car and I thought he was gonna go punch them. One of them was just crying. It was crazy. I have like an Instagram Instagram story that I took after because I was too scared to film at the time. I'll post that up here, but it was nuts. Living downtown never ceases to surprise you. So my apartment's like not as trashed as it has been on some of my Saturday morning clean, but it's definitely not clean. All right, that's it. I'm procrastinating. I'm gonna start cleaning now. I just can't get over. some apartment 
appointments today in two hours so I need to shower and I'm gonna start some laundry and stuff and then I'll check in with you as I'm heading out to go show off these apartments these are some good ones today the budget is a thousand two hundred so I think that we'll have some options that'll be like really cool and relevant for you guys to see that aren't like crazy high priced apartments I'm excited didn't realize this was still here but that is the car that got hit last night and now just like the next morning at like 10 30 the tow trucks are finally here and the car's still there so you can see like the front tires off those doors are completely bashed in it was really bad and it was like stuck in the middle of the intersection and then some guy came out and yelled at them and now they're taking it away okay i'm late i do this every single time hopefully i still have enough time to take the bus all right let's go get this girl some apartment damn that sucks so bad the person did not have a good day Monday. I am making a recipe I've not ever tried before from Half Baked Harvest, but like I'm kind of like half using her recipe, half making it up. I do that 90% of the time. I don't ever want to buy all the random ingredients, so I substitute them and make things with what I have on hand. This though is going to be a Thai turmeric chicken and noodle soup. I am very excited. It sounds delicious. And for being like very fancy seeming, it sounds like it's pretty easy. So I thought I would show you guys how to make this. I'm going to show you my delicious dinner. She says she the one, I bet she thinks she is Stand on high, no trust, I don't know where you been I need a break, on the brakes I'm on a wave, like Lake Michigan, cold She the one, bet she thinks she is Stand on high, no trust, I don't know where you been I need a break on the brakes I'm on a way like Lake Michigan Shorties out here playing Playoffs, first seed You deserve a jersey Hanging from the nose, please All up in the rafters This that happily ever after Nah, wrong page, different chapter She said slow down, then went faster Wait, I might be the realest one that got away 
I just talked to God, I had a lot to say Had to get thanks, cause I feel great I need a space, I gotta think Cause I'm on my way up, taking no pay cuts I need my right hand, should be a lay up Covered in fake love, how you gon' stay down If you can't wait up she said she the one, I bet she thinks she is Saying I don't have no trust, I don't know where you been I need a break, on the brakes I'm on a wave, like Lake Michigan oh. She the one, bet she thinks she is Saying I don't have no trust, I don't know where you been I need a break, on the brakes I'm on a wave, like Lake Michigan She said she the one, I bet she thinks she is Sam don't have no trust, I don't know where you been I need a break, on the brakes I'm on a wave, like Lake Michigan, go She the one, bet she thinks she is Sam don't have no trust, I don't know where you been I need a break, on the brakes I'm on a wave, like Lake Michigan Shorties out here playing Playoffs, first seed You deserve a jersey Hang it from the nose, please All up in the rafters This that happily ever after Nah, no, wrong page, different chapter She said slow down, then went faster Wait, I might be the realest one that got away I just talked to God, I had a lot to say Had to get thanks Cause I feel great I need a space I gotta think, cause I'm on my way up Taking no pay cuts, I need my right hand Should be a lay up, covered in fake love How you gonna stay down if you can't wait up? Final product, we have the turmeric marinated chicken thighs uh, These are not chicken thighs, these are chicken drumsticks in here Then the kale and the sauce and everything You gonna try it with me? Yeah, how am I supposed to eat the chicken with my fingers? With your hands? It's gonna be so messy. Look, I don't know. I don't have the answers for these questions. Oh, good, very good. What's the like base of the broth? Coconut cream and red curry. Oh, really hot. All right, guys. I'm gonna wrap up this vlog here. I'm gonna eat my dinner. As always, if you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you haven't already, definitely hit the big red subscribe button. I post at least two videos a week. Also, go over and follow me on Instagram. I post a ton more over there and I'd love for you to be able to keep up with me. And follow me on Twitch. I do Cooking with Kai two times a week, Tuesdays and Thursdays at 6 p.m. Central Standard Time and I would love for you to join. I am super excited for all of the content and big things I have coming out for you guys this year. So, follow along. I love you. Thank you so much. I'll see you next time. Sand don't have no trust, I don't know where you been I need a break, on the brakes I'm on a wave, like Lake Michigan